feel like the similarities with the shop and other shops I've worked at is it's a tattoo shop. As much as people think of Fritz Street as like this, you know, kind of behemoth in the globe as far as like where, like, you know, kind of destination shops go, like, you know, Kings Avenue, Fritz Street, and Inksmith, and all the big ones, you know, Chicago, State of, Grace. State of Grace, everywhere, you know what I mean? Like, you've got those beacons in the world now. Fritz Street, you can still come into the shop and get a fucking kanji tattoo. You can come in the shop and get a fucking tribal, you know what I mean? Like, you can get regular ass tattoos here, but they're just going to be done on a level of excellence. Like, everything that comes out of here, it doesn't matter what it is, it's going to look nice. And it's, it's kind of refreshing because you have people who are doing custom tattoos every single day, but on top of it, they're fitting in doing, you know, names and crosses and walk-ins. And it, you know, it, it's, it, I feel like that's, that's where the, the similarities end almost. Because a lot of places, they're just strictly appointments or they're just strictly walk-ins. And it's cool that there's like the nice combination of the two here. On top of the fact that, you know, obviously, you still have the same dynamic of every tattoo shop where it's like your people are drawing dicks on your drawings and you know listening to, fighting over the radio and i had 35 bucks and i got tattooed and the dude knew i was 17 handed him my id whole nine yards handed my id knew i was 17 and he was like don't tell your don't tell your folks where you got it and i said okay and i sat there and he fucked it up just a solid black star he had like pick this pick he's like you have 35 bucks i'm like yeah and he goes pick from this sheet and it was like star clover like heart and i was just like star black and he was like all right so he did it and it was terrible it looked firstly i mean obviously everyone who works here i love everyone who works here they like become some of my better friends in the world um jordan's one of my dudes i love working with emiliano he's a fucking maniac and i love that him and i can just do push-ups in the back room and he understands that it, yeah you just got to do push-ups sometimes and stefano's one of the best dudes ever